Alright, so I'm back with the kindergarten and I figured out what you have to do for Sandy's mission. So you just have to take money with you. So, uh, it said you need like three ten dollars and this will get bugs to mess with you, I think. I have need to get 20 more cents. Okay. Ooh, no. I want to have 310. There we go. Okay. So now we can go. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Uh, sure. Hmm. I smell money. Sniff. Yeah, someone is definitely carrying more than three dollars around here. So wait, if you have three bucks, he ought... He just takes it from you. Or if you have more than three bucks, he can smell it. That's weird. Hey kid. You carrying any cash? Yes. Excellent. Give me a hat or I'll split your empty skull with my foot. Fine. Here. Yeah, I don't want my skull split. Good boy. I don't go tell the teacher about this. Or you might turn out like... Turn out missing like that Billy kid. Right. Tell the teacher the bugs threatened you. So wait, I got new hints. I want to see what these hints are. Bugs will take half of your money if you bring more than three bucks to school. You need to get rid of bugs in the schoolyard to start the day with more than three bucks. Okay. You need to have the cigarettes by the time you go to get the laser pointer from the bathroom. That's for Jerome. Did I get any more or was that all? I think that was all. Okay. Well, all I know is to go talk to the teacher. I'm Miss Applegate. I have been well endowed <laughs> with excellent teaching qualities. Bugs stole my money. He did. Interesting. I'll make you a deal. Bugs is a real troublemaker. He's violent and endangered to others. If you go over there and challenge him, I'll make it worth your while. Okay, well send it for me. I'll give you a gold star. We all love gold stars, don't we? Okay. Um. Okay. What if he hurts me? We'll build character. Is this legal? Probably not, but this is how I can start my underground kid fighting ring and it's a risk I'm willing to take. Sounds interesting. Um, okay. Oh, how I love a good kid fight. Just go over and push him a little bit. When he attacks back, just yell for me and I'll put a stop to it. Okay. So we just have to go push him. What do you want, dweeb? I'm not giving you your money back. Get out of here before I squish you. Squishing me won't make your dad come back. My dad will come back. He just went to the store to get some cigarettes is all. Get out of here or I'll beat you so hard it'll make him proud. He'll never be proud of you. Yes he will. If you don't leave right now, I'll kill you. Dying wouldn't be so bad. Fine, you asked for it. This is for you, Dad. Accept your fate or call for teacher. Obviously, call for teacher. Bugs! How dare you attack another student unprovoked again? That's the last straw. I'm sending you to the principal's office so he can finally expel you. No, please, don't. He started it. He's a liar. He said my dad was never coming back. Well, he's right. And after this little incident, neither are you. I'll go to the principal's office or I'll have the janitor carry you there. But, but, go. Stupid rat. We could have been friends if you didn't rat me out. Oh, happy day. I finally rid of that little degenerate. Here's your good gold star, as promised. Thanks. Hmm. I, you've got me thinking, though. Jerome thinks he's so high and mighty because he's the principal's kid. Why don't we arrange a trip for him to visit Daddy? Maybe we could. Well, that's what I like to hear. Come see me during morning time and I'll tell you what to do. Okay. See you then. Well, let's go talk to Cindy now. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Wanna be my boyfriend? Sure. Heh. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. And we'll totally be the cutest couple in school. But first you have to do something for me. Uh, like what? You see that girl over there? Absolutely. She's by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you'll ever meet. I'm going to take this gum and stick it in her hair during morning time, got it? Yeah? Oh yay, this is going to be so great. She'll finally get what she deserves. Just like her brother did for dumping me. Come find me for morning time after you've done it. Okay. Okay, so we have to put the gum in our hair in the morning time. Uh, spend the apple. Okay, children, it's time to start the day. Everyone head inside for morning time. Go inside. Good morning, children. It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time, where you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. 
As long as you're the best you, you can be. Go find the partner. Okay. So let's go talk to Cindy. Uh, didn't mean to do that. Well, what are you waiting for? Stick that gun in her hair. Okay. Oh, I don't really do the whole morning buddy thing anymore. My brother Billy was normally my buddy, but he's missing. Did you just... You did. You put gum in my hair. That's so mean. Cindy put you up to this, didn't she? Well, I don't even care. Leave me alone. Okay. How we talk to her? Did you do it? Oh my gosh, she totally did. Wow, what happened? What did she say? Did she cry? I bet she cried. She's still crying. Yes, I'm so happy. Now you can be my morning buddy. Jocelyn makes you my boyfriend. As my boyfriend, you get the honor of playing house with me. Okay then. Um, before we do that, you need to get cleaned up. No way any boyfriend of mine is going to bleed all over me. Go to the bathroom and wash up. I'll be over by the dollhouse. Okay then. So we have to go to the bathroom. How do I do that? Oh no no no. You can't just leave class without a pass. Okay. Can I use the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? May I use the bathroom? Of course not if you ask correctly. Here's the bathroom pass. Gee thanks. Just be back soon. Sure. Okay. Not so fast though, little dude. I'm gonna need to see your hall pass before I can let you by. Here's my pass. Okay, I'll let you pass, but I can't let you go any further than the bathroom. That's fair. Uh... Hey! Don't you go messing around with those bags. Okay, sorry. What's in that bag? <laughs> What's going on there, boy? What's in those bags? What bags? I don't see no bags. Those bags. Oh, these bags. <laughs> Nothing for you to worry your stupid little head about. Now run along. Stop worrying my stupid little head. Yeah, and he killed me before and then it'd probably happen again. The door won't budge. Someone must be in there. I can hear someone grunting on the other side. The door must be in use. Uh, wait, I'm just supposed to wash up anyway. It's a sink. Wash off the wood. That's the bell. What are you still doing here? Get back to class. Okay, jeez. Oh, you're back. Right. Right on time for lunch. Let's head down to the cafeteria, children. Great, I screwed that up. <sighs> Great. So now I gotta restart. It's a sink. Can I not do it? Oh my god. Do I really have to talk to Cindy before I can do it? <laughs> Frustrating. Alright, now we should finally be able to clean up and get this done. It's a sink. Wash off blood. Alright. So now we can go back to play house with her. Oh, you're back. I'll take that bathroom pass now. Back now. Go back to your morning time. Okay. Welcome home, husband. I hope work wasn't too hard today. You're going to be making dinner tonight. Yes, dear. And at that, I need you too. Have you been drinking again? No, dear, I'm just tired. Oh, sure you are. You're always so tired. I'm sure you won't mind blowing to this then. Is that a breathalyzer? You bet it is. And if you blow so much as, as 0.01, I'm calling for your sponsor. I'll take the test. Good. Blow. 0.32? You're trashed right now. How could you do this to me? You said you would get sober. How can you be a father when you came and take care of yourself? be a father. I, well, while well, you were in prison, it's probably not yours. I'm sorry, I guess I'm in a set of problems to deal with. We can work through this. Sniff. You think so? Yes, I do. Wow, well, Uncle, it's inside. You really are a great guy. So what should we do about the baby? Keep it? That's so wonderful that you would do that. Thank you. No problem. Wow, that was the most fun I've had playing house in a while. You're going to make a splendid boyfriend. I want you to have lunch with me. Okay, great. I'll see you then. Sure. Okay kids, that's lunch bell. Let's go down to the cafeteria for the nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop today. How exciting. So wait, Bugs never came back. Uh, okay. Anyway. Oh hey boyfriend, I saved these bugs. Get time to eat and come sit with me. Okay. I also have to get her the thing from the salad. Okay, let's get the salad. Come on. Yep. Now we just need to get the slop or whatever. 
hide in something once in case you need your slot for lunch. This place, there you go, buddy boy, and don't be shy about coming back for seconds. Plenty of slot to go around. Thanks. Oh, hey, boyfriend, save these slot. Go get something to eat and come sit with me. I have slop. Oh, good. I was just thinking about. Oh, darn it. My stupid mother packed me something that's not vegan. She knows I'm all vegan right now. God, that woman is insufferable. Hey, sweetie, would you be darn go get me something vegan? Something vegan? Yeah, you know. Um, like, I don't know exactly what it means, but I know it's good. So just ask around see if you can find something vegan. Oh, and the sloth is vegan. Here's a salad. Uh, a salad? Oh. Now that I think about it, I guess that would be vegan, huh? Gross. Why do I do this to myself? I don't know. You're being so good to me today. You're probably the most well-trained boy I've ever met. I could use you for something at recess. Hmm, I have an idea. What? I'm really liking the way Lily wears that gum. Maybe we could put something else in there. Uh, what do you have in mind? Jerome was telling me how the janitor has all sorts of gross stuff in his closet. I'm thinking we should find something to give to Lily. Doesn't he keep it locked? Oh, you don't have to worry about that. Look what I have. You have the key? Yep, the girl has her ways. So I'm gonna head over and pay off the lunch lady. So you can get going on. Down to that nasty closet. What about the hall monitor? Oh, that silly boy. I'll be in the bathroom having a cigarette. Just don't go in there and you'll be fine. Okay, lunch is almost over. So listen for the bell while you're in there. The janitor will come back shortly after it rings. So get out as soon as possible. Let's do this. You're good to go. Hurry back. I don't know if you can grab two things while you're in there. This is Dan's closet. It's locked. Unlocked the door. Okay, let's grab the blood. It's a bucket that's catching blood from the thing on the table. This would truly be a vile thing to dump something to take the bucket. No, we probably won't have time to grab something else. So let's just hurry back. Oh, did you did the slot give you the run? Sorry about that. I hope it worked itself out. All the other kids are out at recess now. Go run along. Okay. So we had to do this normally, you know. Well, what did you get? This bucket filled with blood. Oh my god, it's perfect. That's so disgusting. Whose blood is it? Never mind. I don't want to know. We need it. You're the best. Climb up there and I'll call the river. I'm going to get in position. Oh, we're going up that side now. Hey, Lily. Come over here. I want to show you something. Why can't you just leave me alone, Cindy? I'm so sick of you harassing me. I'm not going to harass you. We can be friends. Just come over here. Fine. What is it? Ah! What did you just... Oh. You and your awful boyfriend set me up again. I'm so done with this. You've made me miserable for so long. Aw, oh, come on. I think it's an improvement. You're just so mean. I can't take it anymore. Goodbye, cruel world. Dead? Wow, that hole is deep. Do you think she died? Never mind. I don't care. You should come down from there. Okay. That was so great. You've made me so happy today. I want you to take this flower. It's pretty like me. This way you'll always have a little piece of me with you. Take Cindy's flower. Now you'll have the best thing ever for show and tell. Gosh, I am so great. You sure are. Oh dear, has anyone seen Lily? I don't see her anywhere. Nugget saw where the girl went. Nugget knows. Shut up, Nugget. You didn't see anything. Nugget, I swear to whatever god your messed up family believes in, if Lily fell down that hole you dug, I'm pushing you in after her. Nugget will not give Teacher the satisfaction. Teacher will never take Nugget alive. So, we had two students die and one disappeared. Well, I'm assuming they're dead. Wow, that hole is deep. I can't even see the bottom. We're gonna have to get the janitor out here with the ladder to get them out. Oh, Mr. Janitor! I'm coming, I'm coming. What well, seems to be the problem there, Miss Jiggly Tits? It's Applegate. And I have two of my students stuck at the bottom of this hole. You want me to put the rest of them in the hole? No, I want you to get the ones that are in the hole out of the hole. Can you do that? Oh. Well, that's less fun, but I guess I can do that. It might take a while, though. Might be best if you brought the ones that aren't in the hole back inside so I don't get confused. Very well. Okay, children. We're going to cut recess a little short today. Let's head inside for show and tell. Alright, I hope everyone had a good recess, so I'll get ready for show and tell. Why don't you go first? What did you bring? There's only four of us? Uh, I had to show the flower. A flower? That's pretty boring. What's there to even tell about that? 
It is not boring. I gave him that because he's been a good boyfriend all day. Trust me, it's boring. We just want to skip you and move on to someone more interesting. Okay, who's next? It's not going to be hard to beat that, so don't be shy. Well, children, that was a fun little show and tell. Oh, there's the bell. I hope you all have a fun day today. I'll see you all tomorrow. See you on Monday. That was so sweet of you to show the flower to everyone. You really are the best boyfriend I've ever had. You can keep it forever and always. Joy. Joy of joys. I'll be seeing you tomorrow, boyfriend. See you then. What happened? Did it... Did it crash? I don't know what happened. Uh, oh. Day complete. I'm gonna achieve boyfriend ever. Items unlocked. Cindy's flower. Money earned, 105, so we got 395 in the piggy bank. All right. Well, Monday, again times two. But that's about all the time I have. Oh wait, I'm gonna check that flower first. This is the flower Cindy gave me for being a good boyfriend all day. Perhaps I could show it to someone who needs a little love in their life. Bring the flower to school or leave it here. I don't know if I need that, so I'll leave it there for now. But that's about all the time I have for this part, so goodbye for now.